Hi, my name is Alexa Taunton and this is the professional dispositions video for SPD 501 for Professor Underdown's course. The first, S the first question asks what is the special education teacher's role in supporting um, learning and practice, upholding professional expectations and ethics and what I've come to realize when taking this course is that professional educators wear many hats especially um, special needs educators wear many hats in this course and with that being said um, when getting to know their students the educator needs to collaborate with either the community the students families and even other professional educators that surround them this way we can they can collect data and make instructional decisions on lesson plans to figure out how to best support the student and throughout time the educator will find out what is working for the student and what isn't working for the student and then they can go from there um, this is how they can best support them and give them advice honesty and throughout time get to learn the student on a personal level so they can figure out how can the educator help them the most? Um, a lot goes with being a special education educator and I believe it will be a very stressful first year, maybe first few years for some people. And I think it'd be best that um, special education educators would support, would surround themselves with the support and reflect on um, their practice. With this, they can reflect on some things that they may have done differently and the positive things that they did well so they can pat themselves on the back because everyone needs that. Question two asks, um, what dispositions um, do I currently have? And right now, um, I have a dedication. I advocate. I'm honest. Um, fairness, and I have respect um, for individuals with different diversities. The dispositions I believe that I need to work on is curiosity and reflection. Um, question number three asks about biases and in education. And with biases, I personally think educators need to leave their personal opinions outside of the classroom. There is a time and place for everything, but biases bring on false understanding of someone. Um, an educator will expect false information due to what they see on the outside rather than what they see on the inside. And this could bring negative um, feelings either from the student to the teacher or vice versa and even the family and that's not something um, an educator wants to bring on the student. Um, it can make each party feel uncomfortable and it could make either the student or even the educator feel unwelcome in the classroom. Um, my name is Alexa Taunton and that is my professional disposition.